Hey guys, how are we doing? Welcome back to another video of Stormfall Saga of Survival. How are we doing? I hope you guys are well. Right, so I want to do something a little bit different and I did go through this in my previous video. So here we are, we are going to go into my vault and I'm going to go grab one of the little quests. I've been wanting to do one of these for a little while now, so we're going to do them. And I think I'm going to start with the airship adventure. So I just wanted to quickly check and see what I've actually got in my inventory as well. Just in case, just in case if I need to get myself out of trouble, I know I've got something to come uh, to grab, I guess. So we're going to grab the airship adventure if my screen stops, you know, uh, flicking around. So let's go ahead and claim him. Let's get out of that. Let's go into here and let's use it limited time event has begun so let's get out of here and check it out so i did do i did do this a very very long time ago on my main account so if you guys want to check that out please go through the playlist it is a little while um back that i've done this but i figured i'm on a new account i haven't done this yet and i figured why not and particularly the reason for that would be is because I don't have a high game stage that I can easily demolish the actual event myself. So it's a one and a half skull, which is pretty much the same as a stone ridge. If you guys can do the stone ridge, I'm sure you guys can do this event. So let's get to it. Let's jump in. Uh, not much loot here to speak of, but there are a few enemies, as you can see, just up here to what we might be expecting. So let's go over to our fellow over here so this is the airship dude and he's asking us that we need to acquire all these the levels levels gonna be the hardest thing fixed to use the airship and he just needs some materials and things like that so we don't really need to go into full detail but as you guys can see this is what we need a stack of wood half, half stack of cloth bit of rope bit of the uh, tea some meats and then the lever, uh, lever of course and our price is going to be a purple star skillet as you can see it's actually pretty good for someone that's only in a very early game stage less than 20 i think this will serve as a good weapon for you guys to utilize um, as we're sort of going along but we are going to dive right in and there should be some enemies and things like that here as you can see so let's just get a bit of distance and let's just take out our first little enemy. So whatever he drops, we're basically going to grab. I'll probably even end up grabbing the glands as well, so why not? Um, okay, and we've got our goblin. I'm just going to quickly heal and eat at the same time. Okay, now I haven't actually mucked around with the goblin just yet myself, so actually quite neat to finally uh, attack these guys here. He's got a little map fragment as well, so we're gonna need uh, two more of those. And once we've acquired the rest there, then that'll give us the ability to go to the next stage and phase of this little adventure. So let's grab whatever's in here and we'll keep moving on. I, I am gonna need to start chopping some wood down and things like that as well at the same time. Awesome, got all the rope I need. And you know what, as soon as you guys have actually killed off this zone and completely finished it off, what you're probably best off doing is just looting the place as well, because I think you've got over a day to um, to play around here until uh, the zone goes away for, uh, for good. Oop, let's just kill this little spider, and we've got a boar over here, let's just get over here and take you out, but yeah, so it's free loot as well, awesome. Just hit level 20, and you know what that means, guys? That means I'm able to craft a certain table that's going to give me the ability to start looting. Ooh, there's a few of you guys. All right, let's uh, quickly jump out of the harm's um, way here. So I'll take out one of you guys. Whoop, I don't want to jump into here. What am I doing that for? I'm still trying to get used to this whole blue stacks thing using keyboard and mouse as opposed to my fingers it is so weird uh for a game like this for a, i play other games as well on my pc and there's really not much of an issue with that but playing a mobile game 
Um, yeah, it's it's so different, so different. All right, and okay, we need to back out of here real quick. Let's just get some distance between us. And I'm just gonna quickly eat. And let's see if we can get close enough to this goblin leader and just try to take him out appropriately and we're not. Again, let's just do that. Let's go into here and I have this guy stashed away. Alrighty, so let's come over here again. Oop. And unfortunately my curse points is quite high, so that's the only reason why they're able to um, uh, detect me quite easily, quite quickly. But that's not a problem. Uh, so let's just grab all this. And let's see what you've got. And if you, you know what, if you want, you can take some of these things as well. But for now, what I'm actually going to do, and this will probably be a good idea for a lot of people as well, if you really want to do this yourselves. I'm just going to go ahead and eat that. Let's just drop that and that in here. Because it's nice and close to the start over here. I'll make a little drop chest, if you will. And just keep the necessities with me. So, he's just over here. So it's not too far away, so it's actually, <coughs> excuse me, uh, worked out quite well to be honest with you. Alright, so let's get this guy here. And then basically I'll just use that as storage for now. Like I said, I've got enough time, <coughs> excuse me, to grab everything. So I don't think I'm going to have any sort of problem. So, alright, so I've got this boar over here. He's a bit frisky. Let's just take him out nice and quickly. Okay, and raid that. Oop, nice critical. And so, arguably, you can quite easily do this with the setup that I'm running. You probably don't even need tier 2 um, armor, to be honest with you. Tier 1. I think you'll do just fine with this. I don't think that there'll be much of an issue here. But for now, I'm just going to grab every little bits and pieces. I'll go grab that uh, little barrel chest up there in a minute. And um, I might as well start chopping some wood down just so I can get um, the required wood earlier on. So I'm just going to quickly run over here because I know there's a few of you guys here that maybe back out of that so we'll go grab the wood and let's just grab all as what we wanted to grab there we go and let's just keep going okay so where are we where are we at now so 11 i know i've got three in, in the little chest that i made so that's 14. so i'll need another more uh six planks or sorry six logs and that would be that um, okay, uh, may as well grab some of the rushes, grab the berries just in case. So yeah, so game stage now, I'm on level 20, I should be able to now start doing some raids. Let me know in the comments if you guys are interested in, in me to do early game raids right away, or if you prefer to see, I don't know, some sort of base building video or something like that. Let me know in the comments, because I'll do whatever you guys want me to do. Um, possibly, I'm thinking maybe base build, I'm not sure yet, but I think I'm going to need a lot of resources before that's actually going to happen, so, uh, timeline wise, I think it's going to take me a lot longer to actually get a base set up. If I do get something set up, I think it's just going to be a base full, um, you know, just sort of rush walls, doors, things like that, it's something really that's not going to, um, you know, hold up on any sort of defense, and in addition to that, it's not going to be um, a base where I'm going to have many traps or things like that to start off with. I mean, let's face it, it's only going to be a very basic setup, and so therefore, I probably won't, won't be doing any sort of three skull bases or anything like that. So, let's just take out this fella here. Okay, you should have the last map actually. Once you are defeated, there we go. There you are, right on cue. Take all. I'll eat those. Take the nails. And let's see what you've got. You should actually have some. No, 
You don't. Okay, so I need some berry tea. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm going to need some berry tea because I don't have any of that at the moment. I've got russet iron, I've got all this, but I think I can use the maps now that, that I can go down floors and I may be lucky and fortunate enough to grab all that in there as well. So let's just, well, let's go ahead and study that. Why not? The berry tea, that's going to be fun because I'm going to, I'm not going to be sure if I've actually got that to be honest with you. And, oh no, I need two more bits of log. Okay. Let's just get rid of that. And if we go over here, more details, one, two, and three. Let's claim, I can go downstairs now, I can go into the swamp. Now the swamp zone, it does come with a, um, a disadvantage, come to with a dis disadvantage. So what that would be is every time you get hit by something in down here, you've got times three curse points against you. So not the best thing in the world, but uh, just something to be mindful of and again like I said if your game stage is a little bit higher and you've got accessibility to other things You shouldn't have a problem I don't know why you stopped hitting the original guy, but you did So I'll just leave those there for now Oop, I've got quite a number of spiders here. I better start eating some of this because I will die Come on young spider, thank you and the frog. One more time for me. There we go. Oop. And these things are annoying too. Okay, so let's get busy with this guy here. One more time. Thank you very much. Oop. He's still there. Okay, let's just take out. Oop. Got a few of these guys after me up. So as you can see my curse points now are 200, that's the max that you can do or that you can obtain here in anywhere in the game so my advice is there's no point in fighting it especially if you've got 200 and you're in a zone where it's going to hit you times 3 you may as well just um, leave it as it is but in saying that you don't want to do it somewhere like <coughs> excuse me in a cursed forest uh, reason for that is you'll have a lot more heavy hitting enemies after you and yeah it's not a good time so you're best off um, just sort of suffering the consequences here in the zone uh, if you guys can sort of you know take the the damage Oop. and let's just grab this Oop. again they really annoy you and the fact that they don't pop up on the map is really really annoying um, okay, let's just take you out. Thank you very much. Weapon's going to break soon, so I, hopefully I'm near completion. All right, I need to find these berry t uh, teas. If I can craft, I, I don't know whether or not if I'm going to have to craft these things or will they pop up somewhere for me to grab. Um, I have no idea. I'm kind of hoping that is the case so I don't have to craft it myself, but look, we don't know what's going to happen until that until I've um, successfully gone through the whole zone here. Yep, there's another goblin lead up. And you're only doing 10 hits each time. And now I've got this frog I've got to deal with. Okay, thank you. Uh, let's just take that for now. Do you have anything of interest? I'll just grab that for now. And if you've got... Oop. No, 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 no. Run, 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 run. Okay, I better get some separation between these guys here. Still after me. Oop, I've got two of these guys on me. Uh, can you believe it? Okay, okay, let's just quickly wait for my heal buff to go through. Okay, yeah, this is not good. Because I've got two of these guys after me. And I kind of just want to sort of angle it so I've got one of the guys that I'm hitting not so much the other dude so, so it's th these guys are not making it easy for me there we go okay all right so I've got this other guy here let's just quickly eat that 
get some heal in and thank you and I am going to oh no what did I do that for my bad my bad wrong click of the button so let's go back in um, all right so right now I'm gonna need some water some sort of fluid you do supply that so I've got that there let's just grab and have that just so I can stay off any sort of starvation there we go um, did you have anything interesting for me I want to grab these iron nails because I know they're gonna come um, in handy later on and these things here basically just loot them you're gonna want to loot these things all right and of course I'm back on the the thirst and I'm nearly dead actually uh, this ain't good not good at all actually do I I think I've got stone I do have stone okay <laughs> if I find um, this goblin guy is not going to leave me alone either. Alright, so what I'm going to need to do is I'm going to quickly backtrack because I think I had some... Oh. No, 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 no. Alright, let's just back out quickly. As you can see, it's an easy zone, but because I really don't have all the, um, all the luxuries of a high game stage at my fingertips, um, these sort of things do tend to happen. There we go. Okay. So let's just grab that. Because this is about to break. And I want to craft <coughs> a sling. Which. Ooh, I'm going to need more stone. Which I think I still have about around here. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. I'm gonna need to deal with this um, this whole water situation. Do I have anything in here? Kind of hope that I do, but I don't think I do. Yeah, I really don't have anything here. So, <laughs> alrighty. So, what I'm gonna need to do is I'm gonna have to sort of maybe go back home real quick. Didn't really want to do that, but we're gonna do that. I'm gonna grab some food, come back, finish it off. Um, while I'm doing that as well. Um, I'm going to have to check because at this point I don't think there's going to be any berry tea in those zones. I'm, I'm kind of hoping that there is but it looks like I'm going to have to craft up some, some of my own. Uh, now the airship adventure has got a day and 12 hours so there's plenty enough time for me to actually finish it off and get all the necessary um, resources required. And I noticed that I didn't get any meat either so I'm going to have to deal with that as well. Alright, so food wise, let's come back into over here. Not this chest, but. Uh, no, where did I put everything? Should be in here. Yes, okay. Alright. So, with that out of the way, do I have some. I think I had some water flasks here somewhere and look at that a whole bunch of berries there too anyway where do I have all my water casks is it over here actually I think I might have some here there we go and let's just put you back there okay so we're good to go again what I'm going to need to do real quick is just grab oops Ah, uh, you know what, leave it there for now. Should have some more over here. And, okay. So quickly, 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 grab that. And while I'm here, I may as well dump a few things back over here. I'll deal with this later on, just sort of manage everything else. Uh, I'll need to keep the wood, so I'm not going to get rid of that straight away. Okay, very good. Let's just 
No, okay. You know what? I really should just grab that. I should keep that. Just in case. And um, where did I put you before? Alright, I think I've got enough to go on. What I really wanted to check out is this. So, alright. I'm going to grab some of that. And let's make some berry tea. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry, guys. Um, yeah, so let's make some berry tea. Um, keep that with me just in case. Okay, berry tea coming up. Boom. Alright, so by the time I finish off the zone, if I don't have anything left, I'll have the berry tea. Oh, that's what I needed. That's what I needed. I nearly forgot. Let's just go back in. Okay, where is that chest? Where is that chest? Over here. I need the meat. Take that with me. And we'll head over back to the zone and we'll grab a few things from there. Uh, sorry, grab the rest of the stuff from there. Uh, click, boom. Okay, so as, as we're sort of running along, we stand to get these type of items here as well, but so far I haven't found or come across any of that, which is not good, but it is what it is. It's this what I'm interested in, is the skillet pan. As soon as we get that, we're good to go. I don't think I'll have to loot everything else, to be honest with you, so. Anyway. Um... Let's just open up our little chest over here. So we've got more than enough wood. Actually, got actually have more than enough um, rope. That's fine. I'll keep that there. Keep that there, and keep you close by. Okay. All right. So let's go back down to the second level. Let's finish off everyone down there and call it a day. Now that I know I've got everything, I'm gonna have to run back home as well and grab. Um, a few other bits and pieces, um, being the berry tea. But by the time I'm done through here, there should be at least two berry teas ready for me, uh, ready to go. Okay, so where was that goblin? Just wanted to deal with you real quickly and just finish you off. I actually just realised that I don't have have any proper heals, so that's not good. And my health bar is not doing me justice. Didn't really want to use anything in here, but desperate times. Let's just grab that. Okay. And we should be good. Okay, got a little sneak attack on you. Okay, well, let's just take out this other swamp goblin. That should be it, to be honest with you. But we'll see. Okay, and what did you drop? And to be honest, again, being at the game stage that I am, anything, everything here, I'm just grabbing because I know I'm going to need it all. Oh, didn't see you. <coughs> Excuse me. And this is the big fella. This is the final boss. I mean, from an early game stage point of view, you think this would be quite heavy, but <coughs> just ride it out, guys just ride it out because there you go he's got the lever the lever and also some additional uh, bits and pieces a couple of chests for you to loot as well but yeah just ride it out and you guys will be fine end of the day so let's just sit back grab what's in here and hopefully we'll um, finish this part off got some meat some decent loot here which is good so let's just grab all of that let's just see what's in here there should hopefully be some food maybe okay let's just drink all of that <laughs> what do I keep what do I so I want to take that with me um, actually this is what I could do just realised that, because I don't think I'll need that. 
just saves me coming back down here, but I'm going to have to come back down here anyway. Just wanted to really take that with me, but I want to grab all these, so I'm going to do that off camera. I'm not going to bother with that with you guys here. Actually, let's head back home because hopefully by now there should be at least two berries cooked up. And that should be enough for me to finish off the event. So, in my previous video, because my, of my game stage and everything like that, I actually finished it relatively quickly and I didn't have to sort of muck about and do anything as such, so... Considering that and the type of weapons and armor that I have and heals that I have available to me, you can sort of get why where, you know, there's only so much that you can do. And obviously when you're trying to be time conscious of everything, it's sort of, you know throws a little bit of things out of whack. Alright, what do we got? So I got four over eight. I think I needed a little bit more, but let's just claim the lot and grab it. Just in case. <coughs> um, okay, I don't need these at the moment, so let's just get rid of them. Okay. Over here, let's just Dump that in there. Dump that in there. And in there. Okay. Cool. So let's duck back out. Final time. We'll grab everything. We'll grab the skillet. And that's it. I'm going to call it a video after this. Okay. So let me know what you guys thought about this. Me doing this now with a noob account. A little bit more difficult than my previous video that I did way back when I did it. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this. It was a little bit of a struggle, but we sort of got there in the, in the end um, quite easily. Um, you just sort of got to have your wits about you, I guess, at the end of the day. Just make sure that you're checking everything over as you're sort of going along because you can quite easily get a little bit over in it, um, way too far into it. And yeah, things will happen. So... Let's just grab all of that, and that, and that, and let's go see our friend. Okay, and I think I've got all the resources here, so we've got that, 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 you only need four, but doesn't matter. And finally, the le uh, lever, claimed, done, that's it. So I completely, absolutely got through that. That's too much of a problem. And as you can see, it's actually a really good weapon for the level that I'm at. So I'm actually quite happy with that. 20 attack, 16 uh, wall break, uh, sneak attack 32, 1.2 speed, hearing is 30, <coughs> and 540 to 5. 545 times that I can use this before it breaks. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And to be honest, something like this will get you by for a little while and you don't have to you know, spend uh, resources on making other weapons. Just look after your, your armor and heals and things like that. And I think you guys will be just fine. But that's it. That's going to go ahead and finish it off for the video. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this one, enjoyed me playing through this. Let me know in the comments what you thought about it. Um, but other, other than that, I'm going to catch you in, in another video. I'm not too sure what I'm going to do for the next video. But I think I really have to sort of increase my game stage and get a lot more resources and things like that into my base. But I'm going to see you guys in another video. Catch you next time.